All right, incumbent Sen Sherrod, Senator Sherrod Brown rather voting early in Cleveland this morning before heading to Columbus to wait out results with other Ohio Democrats. Caitlin McCarthy continues our total team coverage. Caitlin is live in Columbus for us. We are checking in with the campaign. Caitlin, as they now begin to wait on results. Tiffany and Brian, as Nicole mentioned, this has been a close race with many important topics at the forefront, and one of them being keeping communities safe. Senator Sherrod Brown says he supports law enforcement and providing them the training to combat the fentanyl crisis. Another key issue in this race is abortion access. Just last year, Senator Brown supported Ohio's ballot initiative to protect abortion in the state's constitution. And earlier this week, we spoke with Senator Brown about another key issue that's very important to voters, gun crime. Well, we need we, we need better gun laws, gun laws that not not violate the Second Amendment or take people's right. I don't care if people hunt. That's fine. Um, but people should we should, people that have had mental health issues should not be able to just go into a store and buy a gun. We need background checks on them. Uh, younger people shouldn't be able to carry guns to school, obviously. Um, we passed a gun, bipartisan gun safety law last year, um, or a couple of years ago. I think that made sense. I think we should look at all of those. Uh, people shouldn't have these assault weapons. As the polls close in just about an hour and a half, Senator Brown's supporters will be gathering here at the Hyatt Regency Hotel in downtown Columbus to watch the election results roll in. But for now, reporting live in downtown Columbus, Caitlin McCarthy, 19 News.